Well, one piece of advice I would give is for the people who live here in America, we kind of have first world problems. You know, if you've ever heard that, it kind of means that a lot of our problems don't amount to the problems of people who are of lesser uh, fortune than us. When you got to think about these first world problems that we have, that those people are just like you. They have the same amount of worth as you, and you have to sit down and think, wow, I really am blessed. My uncle Mark, he actually works in Africa with genocide prevention. He had these set of values and he would stress them constantly. He, he's, he's, in my eyes, he's one of the people I look up to the most. I've always loved uh, hip hop and rap music. Even if I wasn't good at rapping, I just want to do it and like forever. It's like my favorite thing. I talk a lot and I uh, have a lot of opinions and stuff, whether it be, um, of the majority, but I want to. I feel like I can stress them through my rap music. During finals week, I actually made an eight-song album, and uh, it was called Exit Interview. And I basically just got out everything I felt about anything. It's it's actually pretty messy because it's just me like giving opinions and stuff on school and religion and government. Just you know, it's a whole slew of things, and it's uh, yeah, it's it's rough, but I like it because it's kind of a piece of me. It feels like. More and more now, but it's the fourth down, and my ankle sprain. It hurts these voices in my brain saying you need to stop all.